cat's eyes can see even the most elusive prey in the dark. Saving this can of fish for when I was really hungry. Stop looking at it like that. something that catches your eye. If you're borrowing a book, please register it in the log. The restricted section is currently not lending any books. Oh, it's you, little cutie. It's so good to see you. More refreshing than a strong cup of tea in the afternoon. You're meant to be working, but you don't seem to have your heart in it at all. I mean, other than Jean, who really works that earnestly anyway? So, did you have something you needed? Or did you just come to see me? Nothing specific? You must just be here to see me then. <laughs> okay, I won't tease you any further. Miss Librarian, got any books to- Hmm, recommended books. Sadly, everything I'd personally recommend is all in the restricted section, which we're not currently lending out. What's with your ominous tone? Oh, right. Would you be interested in checking out the Devat Travel Guide? I think it would be quite helpful for you as travelers here. Ooh, sounds like it could be helpful. Do you think we could take a peek? I suppose I can try to find you a copy from the list. Isn't this Lisa's job? What does she mean, I suppose? Oh dear, that's unfortunate. Our copy is currently being borrowed. That said, it is now overdue. Come to think of it, quite a few of our books are now overdue. I really wish people would just return their books on time. Whoa, is Paimon imagining things, or does the air in here suddenly feel a lot more electrified? <sighs> Such a pain. I'm going out to bring those unreturned books back. If you'd rather get your hands on that cup... Uh, Lisa seems really scary right now. Paimon you really are such a considerate cutie. Let's see. First, we can go to... 
the souvenir shop. It's called With Wind Comes Glory. So let's meet there shortly. Choose. Haven't you heard? Let it rain. Cutie, you're here. Let's begin, shall we? Marjorie, any exciting new items in stock? Why so surprised? Today is such a special day. It's only natural that I'd want a souvenir to remember it by. So it is. In that case, I declare this the day of... The day of my life I wish I could get back because I spent my first ever outing with someone taking them on an annoying errand. Don't you think that's a bit long? <laughs> well, if it's a souvenir you're after, you're in the right place. I'm sure you'll find something that strikes your fancy, Lisa. Or you could let your new friend pick something out for you. Make it more of an occasion. Yes! Yes! Let us pick! This is a historical relic retrieved from... Sure, there's a bit of wear and tear. My goodness! This is one of the three... You sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. My, my. You clearly know a treasure when you see it. The goodness, is that the time? Oh, so you're a fan of... For example, this lion's tooth pendant with Vanessa's name carved into it. It was once a medal awarded to a knight by the great lady herself. Hmm. Oh my goodness. I do apologize. I got so excited when you mentioned Vanessa. I didn't know that book was overdue, even though I take it with me everywhere. I can't believe I didn't put two and two together as soon as I saw you here. <laughs> here you go. <sighs> well, since you look up to Lady Vanessa so very much, please be more punctual next time. Yes, Lisa. I will be, Lisa. Let's go and find the next overdue book.
Welcome to Good Hunter. Table for two? Three! Oh, <laughs> my apologies. Please sit wherever you like and call me over... So we're gonna eat first and bring... Why, of course. The stress of work really takes... Work is that bad, huh? Recommendation is the stick. Star Snatch Cliff is known for its views. Today's recommendation is the stick. Why don't you order us something, cutie? I'm ever so curious to know what your tastes are. <sighs> Why don't you order us something, cutie? This seems like the sort of staple bar food you'd find at the tavern. It you sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. Mm, finished ordering? Which should I choose? Come take a look. There will definitely be something that catches your eye. Hmm, finished or Such a potent aroma. It's almost suffocating. I never thought someone your age would go for a dish like this. I always had you down as a little cutie. Now I'm not. I'm on so full. Time is getting on. I suppose I should carry on with this ghastly thing called work. Have a little chat with Sarah. Would you like to order something else? No, thank you. We're quite satisfied. The boar brisket? <laughs> I'm sorry. I think we took. <sighs> she means the book you borrowed. Oh. I'm so sorry, Lisa. I will bring it to the library myself as soon as I finish work. <laughs> 
Hmm. Okay then. But make sure. Right. On to our. Today's recommendation. There's something strange over there. Come on, let's take a look. our final call for the day. Welcome! Uh, couples are our specialty. Let me know what you'd like and I'll wrap them up next. Ah, uh, yes. Now, which book was it that has the line, A date without flowers is a date without romance? Ah, uh, take the hint! <laughs> Since you're here, and Lisa is here, and this is a flower shop, you might as well get a bunch of flowers, right? Some flowers for Miss Lisa? What would you like? Dandelions are one of our classics, and a personal favorite of Miss Flora, the shop owner. I know, come to think of it, Miss Flora herself gives people the same impression. You sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. Dandelions? They actually sell dandelions? They have a refreshing scent, similar to the one Jean wears. Thank you. Okay, time to get back to business. Donna, do you know why we're here? Back to business? My business is selling flowers. <sighs> Once again, we see a total lack of respect for literature. The Pale Princess and the Six Pygmies. Oh, uh, yes. Oh no, what am I gonna do? I... I lost the book. <sighs> a while back, I realized it was almost due, and I was getting ready to bring it back... But I couldn't find it anywhere. I looked for days, but nothing. It's like somebody stole it. It should have been there, on my bedside table, right where I left it. Uh-oh. That Lisa does some crazy- I heard that. <laughs> well, the blip and their punishment will be three. No, ten times worse than stealing my book. <laughs> 